G.I. Joe. Weekdays at 7.30 on Fox 50. Yo, Joe! trying to become a nerd. <sighs> you see, my problem is, I've got everything it takes to be a nerd. Ah! Except brains. I'm going to school now, Mom. Don't share your wheat germ with all the other kids. They might have other germs. Mom packs health food in my lunchbox. I always sneak in a bologna sandwich. And you know the quill born. Maybe someday I'll get to eat it. Actually, I like school. You see, that's where I first met Audrey Mushnick. Are you all right? Hmm? It looked like you weren't breathing. She doesn't even know I'm alive. If only there was some way to make her notice me. Oops. Sometimes I have the weirdest dreams. It's like I've gone back in time, and I'm the first caveman. <laughs> Booga booga. Uh. Feed me. Yo, I ain't standing in your dream for long. Perfect timing for a commercial break. I need another tub of popcorn. Wait till you see Barbie's trendy little sister. Gorgeous hair, an adorable hat, and even cute little clothes. Meet Stacy. She's got clothes for a party, clothes for shopping at the mall, clothes for school. And that's not all. Stacy doll comes with a backpack and shopping bag. Her skirt, top, and jacket fit Barbie, too. Barbie doll sold separately. I couldn't get this tune out of my head till I heard these flowers, then a heartbeat, and the sound of mushrooms sprouting. It was raining cats and dogs in harmony. Then airplanes hit the high notes. Even the stars came out to play. I think you just wrote a song. Mario Paint. Draw and make music only on the Super Nintendo Entertainment System. Kellogg's Pop Tarts are popping up, up, up. So cool. They're hot. So hot. The taste of real fruit, real hot. Hot, hot, hot. Mm, they taste so cool. So cool. They're hot. So hot. They're cool. Mm. Now, if you want all the hot taste of chocolate and marshmallow s'mores, don't forget your toaster. Mm. Mm. New Kellogg's S'mores Pop-Tarts. Monday on Batman, when unusual robberies plague Gotham. The company! The Dark Knight tracks a chilling foe. Mr. Freeze to you. And makes a shocking discovery. The stolen objects combine into a massive weapon. Very good. A detective. 
to the last. Watch Batman, the animated series, Monday afternoon on Fox. There's got to be a TV out here somewhere. The show's coming back. After I blew up the science lab, I got a job at Mr. Mushnick's flower shop. Mr. Mushnick is Audrey's father. Ever since Audrey was 12, she's wanted to be a fireman. Seymour, stop overwatering the flowers, Seymour. Sorry, Mr. Mushnick. <laughs> Taking care of the plants, I made deliveries. Then one morning, my whole life changed. It got worse. Sorry, Seymour. I didn't see you standing there. I hope I didn't get your homework wet. <laughs> no, I always carry a waterproof notebook. That's kind of funny, since I don't like him. When life gives you lemons, make lemonade. Ah! Gadzooks! Ah. It sprouted! It must have germinated in the wheat germ. Hand over the sandwich, Quillborn. Ow! Find the booby crap me, huh? I'm innocent! So where's the baloney? My business is a bust. Business, what a joke. Shooby-doo-up, what a joke. I've got no business. That's why I'm going broke. I'm going broke. somebody to talk to. Wasting your time with weeds while my flowers go to pot? You're lucky I can't afford to pay you, or I fire you. Feed me. Yo, feed me. Hello, pizza place. I'll take a large pizza, triple pepperoni, maybe some anchovies, and a uh, hold the veggies. Somebody order a pizza? I hope it was Audrey. Mm. Looks like nobody's here. Doing here? 
here. So you're the black rat who ordered the pizza. Uh, 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 Come on, Crowborn. Pay up. I don't have any money. I'm coming back tomorrow to see Mushnick. He doesn't have any money either. Personally, I wouldn't take that off a piece of mulch like him. Of course, I'm bigger than he is. Junior, you're alive. What do I look like? I'm made out of plastic. But, but, but you're talking to me. Nobody ever talks to you, huh? Well, I'll talk to you, but keep it a secret. I've been watching you all day. And was it ever born? But I got a proposition for you. I'm busting out of this overgrown meat locker tomorrow, getting my little green bud back where it belongs. You give me a hand getting home, and maybe a couple of legs, and I'll give you the thing you want most in the world. Passing grade in science? No, meathead. A passing glance from Audrey Mushface. <laughs> now get some sleep. I don't know about you, but I'm a little bushed. That's plant humor. But who are you? Where are you from? How did you... Would you butt out with the questions? I'm trying to be dormant here. What a pest. I'd rather talk to a termite. This is the most exciting thing that's ever happened to me. Come to think of it, it's the only exciting thing Happened to me. Well, me. Uh, uh, back after this. I knew I freed myself for a reason. Don't look now, but Inspector Gadget's crawling your way. He's the funniest oddball superhero around with his goofy gadgets and wacky ways. With orders from the chief and his trusty dog brain, he'll do whatever it takes to track Dr. Claw to the ends of the earth with explosive results. Inspector Gadget's back. Weekday mornings at 6.30 starting Monday. Everybody knows it's on Fox 50. One, two, three, it's as easy as one, two, three. If you don't know what to do. One, two, three, it's as easy as one, two, three. If you don't know what to do. Just close your eyes and hop on the spaceship, the magic of your mind, and watch the magic happen. Babe's World, Babe's World. Watch Babe's World, Thursday at 3, here on Fox 50. It's my water baby, but don't let her get too much sun. It's my water baby. It's Water Baby's Beach Baby. Fill her with water and she feels just like a real baby. She even gets a little tan when you dip her in cold water. But when you rub her with warm water from her pretend Water Baby's lotion bottle, the tan disappears. The Water Baby's Beach Baby from Playmates. I wish F stood for fantastic. I wish kids got to do the grocery shopping. Ew, yuck. When you wish on a treasure troll, who knows what might happen? Treasure trolls are the only trolls that have a jewel in their tummy that you can wish on. What would you wish for? <coughs> I wish cherry cough syrup really tasted like cherries. Treasure trolls with a jewel you can wish on from Ace. Hello. My name is Smokey Bear. And this is my home. A place for you to climb. Sleep. Watch. And play. As long as it's not with matches. Only you can prevent forest fires. There it is, the show. It's back. Today's the first day of the rest of Junior's life. Oops! I can't wait to get down to the shop and see. Pain Driller! Seymour Krell 
boing. Come on, see what I bought at the spurting goods store. They were having a fire sale in the hosiery department. The most amazing thing happened last night, Audrey. Isn't it positively inflammatory? I think it could forever change the way we look at the world. Gosh, do you really think a fire hose could do all that? Hold this. So now you're ordering pizzas and leaving me to pay for them. This time you've gone too far, Seymour. I want you out of here by tomorrow morning. When I was his age, we never ate Chazarai and pizza like that. You ready for some attention from what's her name? It'll make a nice change. I'll just plant the seed of an idea in her head. Seymour's the coolest non-green dude in the world. Must be a crosswind. Uh oh. Has anybody ever told you you're the coolest non green dude in the world? Let's cruise! <laughs> Bringing your plant along is really cool, dude. Actually, it wasn't my idea. With the flow, Seymour. I can get home in no time on this thing. Just hope it knows the way. Aren't you driving? What's driving? I can't wait to shake the dust of this place off my roof. Now, something's going bad. It's a crime of disgrace. You got stone for ground. Walls in your face. Those square things you live in look suspiciously. Like they're made out of someone related to me. You got boxes on rubber that spit out smoke. If this place weren't so sorry, it'd be a big joke. That's why I'm out of here. You know what I'm saying? Home. 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 Where my roots are. That's where I long to be. Away from this foul, funky air. Yeah. Put me there. Hey, see more. Check this out. You see plant and flower, moss and tree. Living in P E A C E. That's home. Sweet home where my roots are. Home. 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 Where my roots are. That's where I long to be. Free. Away from this foul, funky air. Yeah. Take me there. Going back to the city dump where you found me. All right, we're here. I remember when I was just a little toddler, hanging on my mother's limb. I'm gonna cry, Seymour. Smell green, Seymour. Home sweet, <gasps> my home. There's no place like home. Not anymore, there isn't. Just a bunch of stumps where there used to be trees. Petrified Forest Park. Keep off the petrified grass. These ancient trees were gradually fossilized. Uncle Herb! The sign says the forest is 200 million years old. You must have been lying dormant all that time, Junior. 200 million years? No wonder my mouth tasted like... Root rot. Don't worry, Junior. He'll always have a home with me at the little shop. Guess it beats being petrified. How did my wheels get here? Where's the moped? Must have known the way back. You know, I might just put down roots here in the future, cultivate a few friends. You humans aren't so bad, especially with a little salt. It's mighty green of you taking these onions out for a ride, giving them some fresh air. He's not taking them out for a ride, Junior. Yeah, so where's he taking them? It's like some horrible nightmare. Pinch me, wake me up. 
Or at least see if I'm right. It's just vegetable soup. Do you eat vegetable Seymour? I... I don't want to. My mom makes me. Junior was pretty upset about the vegetable soup. I guess he took it personally. Wake up! It's time to get busy. Rise up! Realize your reality. People been running things far too long. If you think you gotta take it, brothers and sisters, you're wrong. Azaleas, Tazinias, all your flora in between. Time to get down, get nasty, get funky, get mean. Ooh, oh, get funky. Got to potentialize your potentiality. Got to focus eyes, feel the energy, attitude lies. Come on, have a little spunk. You may be a lily, but you don't have to be a punk. Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! No cross pollinating, getting stuffed in the pot. Later with spoon and cutting, clipping, tying you up in a knot. Forget irrigating, fertilizing, spraying and stuff. I say enough is enough, and too much is too much. Wake up! It's time to get busy. Wake up! Ooh, wake up! It's time to get busy. Wake up! Junior, what are you doing? Trying to bring back the good old days when plants were plants. And you were lunch. We're through being the weak link in the food chain. Got that? Green is groovy. Power to the pollinator. These gotta be the most unmotivated plants I ever saw. You have to stop this, Junior. If Mr. Mushnick's plants start revolting, I'll get blamed for it. If you don't promise to behave, I'll... I'll have to overwater you. I don't think you can do it, Seymour. Why? Because I'm just a nerd? No, because I'm holding the hose. Ah! Pyrotechnic! Where's the fire? Oh, I guess you already put it out. <sighs> Some people have all the luck. Maybe we could put out a fire together sometime. She wants to put out a fire with me? Sounds like a hot date. Seymour! Oops. Company. Hey, Seymour! What have you done to my shop? <laughs> and to my... My flowers! They're absolutely gorgeous! <gasps> I knew it was a jungle out there, but now it's a jungle in here. Seymour, how did you do it? Do you think I should tell him that it was really Junior? What do I care how you did it? You little nerd Nick, you just don't stop. Oh, you're out of here. I knew he was all thumbs, but I didn't know they were green. Looks like you got your J-O-B back from Mr. Mushbrain. Got the spark flying with what's her name, too. I tell you, Seymour, without me, your life would be a real mess. Does everybody have problems like this when they're 13? We'll be right back after these commercials. Sheesh. Wait till you see Barbie's trendy little sister. Gorgeous hair, an adorable hat, and even cute little clothes. Meet Stacy. She's got clothes for a party, clothes for shopping at the mall. For school, and that's not all. Sharing so much fun to do. Some Stacy clothes fit Barbie too. Barbie couldn't have a better sister. Stacy, Barbie's trendy little sister is here. Stacy doll comes with a backpack and shopping bag. Her skirt, top, and jacket fit Barbie too. Barbie doll sold separately. Access Hershey's chocolates. She says. 
says. Meet me at the mall. Cool. What you gonna say next? Listen. Do you have a crush on anyone? <laughs> you can't believe your ears are eyes. Teen Talk Barbie, what a surprise. <laughs> each Teen Talk Barbie doll says four different fun things. Barbie dolls each sold separately. Kids, listen up. Right now, your favorite Fox kid show can win you a $10,000 Toys R Us shopping spree. It's incredible. Just watch Fox and pick the show you like best. Then run to Toys R Us and fill out an entry form with your choice. You might win this totally toy-rific shopping spree. But wait, there's more. On that day, we'll even name the store after you so everyone will know you're the winner. Have you ever heard of a better prize? And there's still more. 150 other winners will get $100 Toys R Us gift certificates. Wow! Enter by September 21st and you could be a winner. Boy, this show makes me feel like a kid again. Now, back to the show. I guess everything turned out all right after all. With Junior to make the plants grow, the shop is making lots of money. Everybody wants something from me. How can I run a business with all these customers around? Best of all, now Audrey knows I'm alive. You're breathing down my neck, Seymour. What did I tell you? Junior's still trying to teach Mr. Mushnick's plants to be revolting. All right, you bunch of sapless wonders. Straighten up. I can't hear you. I guess we all have to face a few challenges in life. Hand over that milk money, quail boy. Hey, where's my moped? Somebody uh. took my wheels. Wonder who? <laughs> Osborne, the world's greatest daredevil entertainer. And right now I'm inside a cannon and I'm about to be shot over the entire state of Nevada. But before I go, I just want to remind you about my new show on Fox. It's called Super Dave. I think you're going to love it. Don't miss Super Dave, all new next Saturday morning on Fox. All right, tell me when we're going to... Yahoo! Get ready to jam.